So if you're starting a print on demand business on Shopify, one of the most important things is who you are going to use to fulfill your products. And in this video today, uh, we're going to be counting down what I think are the top 10 print on demand apps available to you on Shopify. We're going to be taking a look at the quality of products. I'm going to show you guys a whole bunch of samples uh, that were sent to me from these apps uh, that I reviewed in the past here on my YouTube channel. I've been doing print on demand now for almost five years uh, and I've built a little bit of relationships uh, with some of the apps that we're going to be talking about here in this video. So pretty cool. I will be including uh, reviews of some popular products from these apps. We're also going to be talking about product availability. So depending on which app you are choosing, uh, you might not be able to sell the product that you want. So the rankings uh, that we'll be taking a look at here in this video uh, are going to uh, based, be based somewhat on what products are available from those apps. Okay. We're also going to be talking about production time, right? So we'll take a look at the estimated production time of the products inside of each app. And that way you can see if that is going to be something that you are willing to work with when you're considering which app you want to use. And we'll also be talking about the overall reliability of the print on demand apps. Now, one thing I will say uh, is that these are my top 10. If you guys have other apps that you're using that you want to drop in the comments, uh, please do so. One thing I will say too before we jump in uh, is that this is going to be a rather long video. I'm putting some timestamps on the screen right now where you guys can see the different apps that I'm going to talk about today. And if you wanted to fast forward to one of them, you definitely could. Another thing that I want to say is that the rankings here are not really uh, super important. They are when we get into uh, the top five, but basically apps 10 through six, uh, there's really uh, no ranking there, right? I'm just trying to show you 10 apps, but the top five uh, are definitely my favorite uh, apps to use with a print on demand store. Uh, and we'll jump into it right after this. So before we jump into the video today, the first thing you're gonna to need to do is smash that like button. I know it sounds like a joke, but I'm 100% serious. When you hit the like button, you're telling the YouTube algorithm that my videos are good uh, and that you like it. So if you do like it, please click the like button uh, and it'll really help my channel out. So I also have uh, this camera here, which I'm going to be showing uh, some better views of the products here. But the first app that we're gonna look at is Printful. Uh, this is number 10 and some of you guys might be thinking, wow, why is Printful number 10? I thought Printful was awesome. Honestly, Printful is a great app. I think they're a little bit overrated. The only reason I would really recommend them is if you wanted to sell hats and you wanted to get uh, some embroidered products. These are two uh, embroidered hats uh, from Printful. They are very nice. The pricing is pretty good. Like I said, if you wanted to go and get some embroidered products, uh, I would definitely recommend Printful uh, for them. Let me try to position these so I can show uh, some better close-ups here. My camera is not focusing. I don't know what is happening here. There we go. Camera is focused. So now you guys can see uh, some good close-ups uh, of them. Um, like I said, these hats uh, are from Printful. I think they are really good uh, for embroidery and everything else I think you can get from another app cheaper. And we're gonna jump into uh, a whole bunch more today and hopefully expose you to a little bit more uh, about print on demand. So our number nine and our number eight apps, I actually don't have any samples for here, but pretty much the rest of them uh, I will today. So number nine uh, is Fuel. Now this is an app uh, that is based in the United States. It is a free app, meaning you can simply just install it on your store. You don't have to pay for a subscription uh, or anything like that. And they have a wide range of products, everything from apparel uh, to some drinkware and things like that. It's a great option. Definitely not something that I'm super experienced with. I do have a bunch of students that do use them and have had good experiences with them, but I wanted to include it here uh, in this list. Another app, number eight is Spod, S-P-O-D. Um, this is an app that is 
also free. They have production facilities in the USA and also in Europe. So depending on where you are selling to, you would just want to make sure that you are selecting the correct shipping method uh, there. So like I said, I don't have any samples for this, but the next app uh, is going to be uh, WC Fulfillment. Now, this is a, another free app that's based in China. They have a ton of really unique products. You can see several of them behind me right now. Actually, uh, I'm going to grab some and show you. So here are a couple products from the WC Fulfillment app. And in addition to this, they have a ton of super unique uh, products that you can sell on your Shopify print on demand store. But I wanted to highlight these two because I had samples handy. Uh, the first one is this cell phone wallet case. I'll show close ups in a second. Uh, the next is a print on demand skateboard. Now this skateboard is actually part of a set of three. The rest of them are on the shelf behind me. I didn't take them all down, but you can basically create uh, skateboard wall arts with the WC Fulfillment app. You can do it from one board all the way up to five boards where your design can continue uh, onto multiple boards. And then when someone hangs it on the wall, it basically looks like a canvas, except it is a skateboard. And first we will start uh, with the wallet case. Definitely a really cool product. You put the phone in right there. You can also put money in it and debit cards and credit cards and all that stuff. Uh, print quality is definitely uh, very nice. You can see here that everything is crystal clear. Obviously, it, this is not uh, real leather, but it is definitely durable. I believe these are about $10 through the WC Fulfillment app. Uh, definitely a really cool product for those that are selling phone cases and want to sell something a little bit more unique. I think this is something that you could sell today if you wanted to, even though this product has been around for a few years. I've sold a whole bunch of these uh, in the past. Definitely a cool product. Check it out. WC Fulfillment has this uh, available to you. And now we'll take a look at the skateboard. Uh, so there is a couple of scratches on it. I've had this for uh, about a year or so. And from time to time, I take it out and I shred down the street on my skateboard. No, I'm just kidding. I don't actually skateboard. But I believe that uh, you could if you wanted to. Uh, I believe you could install uh, like deck tape on this and put wheels on it and be able to actually use it. I just am not very coordinated, so I never uh, skate. But uh, the print quality is great. Uh, you guys can see it here. Uh, you can even see here on the black, right? See how there's all those little like rectangles and squares. You can see all the scratches too uh, that I've scratched it up. I've had this for about two years uh, from uh, WC Fulfillment, but you can see all these little squares. Right? That's actually a part of the design. It's supposed to look like a textured uh, black design. It's not just supposed to be a, a solid black background. Uh, and you can see that it did actually pick it up, which was uh, quite impressive uh, in my opinion. And like I said, you can sell this uh, all the way up to a total of five boards. Uh, you can do one board if you want, or you can make a design that goes over multiple boards. Definitely a super unique product, hyper profitable too. Uh, you can make some great profit margins on this. Definitely something that you should uh, check out if you think that you're niche uh, or your niche, sometimes I say it the other way, um, if your niche uh, might want uh, a skateboard wall art. Definitely a cool product. Definitely check it out uh, inside of the WC Fulfillment app. So we'll take a look inside of the app now. Um, they have a lot of resources here too, which is pretty cool. Not every print on demand app does this. Uh, they have a live chat option here in the bottom right. Uh, they also have some training, some uh, seller resources. They have a Facebook group as well. You can either you can even hire a designer through their website. Uh, we'll just click on uh, some frequently asked questions first and take a look uh, at some stuff. So uh, one of the things that I wanna talk about here, I'm trying to find it. Uh, is about uh, the shipping, right? So how long does shipping take? Um, basically, uh, they ship from China. So depending on where you live, you're going to have a different uh, shipping time. Now, their production time, which you saw on that page that we were just on, it said it was about two to seven days, right? So once your order is placed, within two to seven days, they will actually print your product. Now, here on their shipping page, uh, you can see that all of these countries here, uh, the shipping speed is two to five weeks. Now, that is pretty broad, right? Whenever you're using an app that is based in China, uh, you could have a swing, right? It could take two weeks to ship or it could take up to five, right? And they're being honest about it here. I will say 
I have sold uh, over the past five years or so hundreds of items uh, from WC Fulfillment. Um, I have had items take up to five weeks. I've also had items take two weeks, right? I think it's definitely super important uh, to make sure that you are articulating your shipping times to your customers in, a, in an accurate way, but also in a way that's not going to scare them. And at the end of this video today, I'll give you guys kind of a rundown on how I like to explain shipping to my customers in order to set a clear expectation, but also to make sure that they don't get scared uh, to actually order the product. Now, in terms of product options, right, that was one of the things that we we're going to look at today with these apps. Uh, they have some really cool stuff. We're here inside uh, of the product creation where you can select uh, a product. You, you can see that they have everything from watches. They have some all over printed options as well. Uh, they have that cell phone wallet case. They have regular phone cases, hooded blankets. Uh, here's the skateboards. They have joggers, tons of different types of hoodies and other types of apparel. Uh, they have lap book, uh, laptop, I almost said lap, lap book, uh, laptop cases as well, which I actually have one um, right here. Uh, this is a MacBook uh, laptop case from WC Fulfillment uh, that they sent me as a uh, sample. Let me just get this out of the way. And while they are based in China, they do have some options here with uh, some regular types of apparel uh, that are made here uh, in the USA. And maybe maybe not made, maybe the actual product is made somewhere else, but it's printed and it ships uh, from the United States. So overall, WC Fulfillment is a cool app. They have had a little bit of a rocky history from time to time. If you check their review inside the Shopify app store uh, you will see uh, some people that are reviewing them very poorly because in late 2019 they sort of had a few hiccups uh, I recently did a poll inside of my Facebook group and asked if anybody was using them uh, and the results that people said that they were currently experiencing with them uh, people said that they were they were fine right that they were using them and there was no issues but like I said if you do check their reviews there has been some hiccups in the past so just make sure if anything feels off when you are using them that you maybe pump the breaks a little bit. I didn't want to uh, go through this review of them uh, without mentioning that. So our next app is called AOP Plus, and this is going to be a perfect app uh, for anybody who doesn't live in the United States. Um, this is a free app that is based in the United Kingdom. They have a ton of super unique products that we will take a look at in a few seconds. But like I said, they are a free app based in, in the United Kingdom. So if you are selling to Europe and you want to sell with an app that is also based in Europe, this could be a great option for you. And the product that we're gonna take a look at is this guy right here. This is one of the coolest print-on-demand products I have ever seen. Uh, this is a custom pillow uh, that they sent me uh, to review. And you guys can see that the pillow is actually cut in the shape of the Ninja logo. So no matter what shape your design is, they will actually cut it uh, to look like it, right? So if you're selling anything for pet lovers uh, or people that uh, want a picture of their baby or something like that, uh, they will cut it out in the shape uh, of it, right? So I'll show you guys some close-ups here of the print quality um, definitely definitely pretty good right like pretty good I'm not sure if my close-up is that great or not uh, but um, really good really unique product uh, something that I think a lot of people could have some success with in a ton of different niches and definitely one of the many unique products that AOP plus has on their app so here inside of the AOP Plus app, we'll take a look at some of the product options uh, that they have. Obviously your standard t-shirts, we'll kind of scroll through. You guys can see they have a whole bunch of different mask options. They have uh, this neck gaiter option, which is you know not really a mask, but it's something that kind of pulls up uh, over the entire uh, face. As we scroll down, they have a ton more apparel. Um, like I said, they do have that really uh, unique pillow as well. But basically, if you're looking to sell any sort of apparel, uh, even some hoodie dresses, which is basically just a really long hoodie that looks like a dress. Uh, this is a great option, especially if you are uh, selling to the United Kingdom and you want an app uh, that is based there. You can see here, uh, we'll just pick a random product here. We'll look at this uh, varsity jacket here. You can see that they list the pricing here. So uh, it's $26.99 for the jacket plus $8 to ship and then processing time of about three uh, to five days. So again, depending on where you're selling to, the shipping times are going to be a little bit uh, longer or shorter. They also have a hooded blanket, which is a product that I love. I'll uh, we'll be talking about that a few times during today's video. 
Um, but like I said, definitely a cool app. Lots of different apparel options for adults and even for kids. Uh, and if you're looking to use an app that is based in the United Kingdom, this could be a great app for you. I have not personally sold a lot with this app, but I do uh, communicate regularly with the owner uh, of the app. They also have a Facebook group as well. I have tons of students that have sold with them in the past too successfully. So definitely a cool app that you guys should check out. All right, app number five uh, is actually Pillow Profits. It's, this is not a uh, free app. This is actually a paid app. It's gonna cost you money just to use this app on your store. It costs $29 a month. Um, they're also based in China. And before you run away scared, uh, paid app based in China. Uh, this is a great app. I've sold a lot of products uh, with Pillow Profits in the past. I'm putting a clip on the screen right now uh, of one of my favorite products ever to sell. These are car seat covers. Uh, the quality on these products is absolutely awesome. Uh, the car seat covers feel soft. The print color uh, is also very vibrant. So like I said, paid app based in China. Why, uh, Joe, would you recommend uh, um, this app because it's paid and they're based in China. Well, they have some of the most unique print on demand products that I have ever seen. So we're going to take a look at uh, some of the ones that they have in here right now. Really uh, extensive line of footwear, tons of different types of shoes and even boots. Uh, you can see these hats here. Uh, these are a little bit different than the printful hats that I showed you earlier because they are not embroidered. They are actually just printed over the entire hat. So if you wanted to have a different print on the bill of the hat in the front, uh, you could do that, right? It's a really cool option for, for hats. Um, like I said, they also have a ton of different footwear options, including these aqua barefoot shoes. Um, pretty unique, right? One of the products that I've had a lot of luck with, uh, with Pillow Profits as well, are these shoes uh, right here. You actually have two options when selling shoes with Pillow Profits. Not with every shoe, but with some of them, uh, you can sell it with no box and you'll get a little bit of a cheaper price. So you can see here that this economy, no box, low tops uh, are $26.99. And if you scroll down, uh, we should see an option here that has it with the box uh, right here. I believe, uh, and the price is a little bit higher, right? So if you're looking to save a little bit on margin, uh, probably choose the option with no box. Honestly, I don't think anybody is gonna think anything of it. Uh, they're just ordering print-on-demand shoes. These are not Nikes or anything special like that, so I don't think the box matters uh, a whole lot. In terms of uh, delivery times and production times, yes, these products are coming from China. So as always, when you are shipping internationally, there is a always an asterisk there, right? Where there there could be a delay, right? But in my experience, they have usually been pretty spot on. You can see here uh, with these shoes that they are estimating between 10 and 25 days uh, total delivery time from the point of order to when it is on your customer's doorstep. And like I said, at the end of this video today, I will give you guys a rundown on how I like to write my shipping time so that way I can explain it in a way that doesn't scare people but also sets realistic expectations for them. In terms of quality with Pillow Profits, uh, this app has been around forever. Uh, honestly, they produce some really nice stuff. I don't think I've ever had a quality complaint uh, when it comes to a Pillow Profits item. Definitely a cool app, even though they are based in China and even though uh, they do cost money to use. If there was a problem, Product that they had that you could not find anywhere else, I think that it would be worth it to install and pay uh, the money monthly uh, in order to get access to that product that you want to sell. Now, the next app is actually another uh, free app based in the United States. This is the T-Launch app. Uh, they have a ton of really cool things, but the thing that they do best, in my opinion, is personalization. And before we take a look at that, I want to show you uh, some of their products. Let me turn this camera on. As you guys can see behind me, these canvases uh, are from T-Launch. Honestly, if you're going to sell canvases and you're looking to sell something of this size, I think T-Launch is the place uh, to go. They have the largest canvases that I've seen. The pricing is great and the quality is stupendous. I'm going to do my best here to show some close-ups of uh, the print. This is a rather large canvas, so I cannot show the whole thing at once, but you can see that the black is solid black. The yellow is also solid yellow. Everything looks very nice. And like I said, if you wanted to sell canvases and you wanted something of this size, I would definitely recommend T-Launch. Now, the thing that T-Launch is perhaps best used for 
in my opinion, is personalized products. So here on their personalized tab, uh, you can very easily sell personalized items such as canvases or mugs or even phone cases or blankets or doormats, right? The way that this process works here, if you see this image at the top, you are basically creating a design with a transparent portion coming through and then someone gets to put their picture uh, behind your design and it basically prints a really cool item like the one they have there uh, for you to see. Another thing that T-Launch does really well is combo apparel. So right here you can see they have a whole bunch of different options here. Basically, you're going to pick your first garment, and then your second one, you're going to upload two different designs, and they're going to print them both for you uh, as a package deal for your customer. Definitely something that's super cool if you wanted to sell like mom and baby or like husband and wife type products and you wanted to do it on apparel. They also have the same option available right here with mugs. Uh, definitely a cool thing. I have not seen this with any other app uh, built in like this where it's going to be super simple for you to be able to do stuff like this. Definitely a cool app based in the United States. Great shipping times, great shipping prices, all that. They also have a Facebook group that you can check out as well. All right, app number three uh, is also a free app based in the United States. It's called Shine On and they are the leader in print on demand jewelry. We will take a look at them. I'll show you some samples. But like I said, if you wanted to sell jewelry, this is the app for you. I have right here a print on demand dog tag from the Shine On Jewelry app. I will get my camera and I will show you some close ups of it as well uh, before we jump into the app. One thing to note is that the uh, print quality uh, is very nice, but so is the actual quality uh, of the jewelry. Now, the first time that I actually ever handled a Shine On jewelry product, I thought I was going to get something that felt like it came out of a vending machine, and that could not be further uh, from the truth. I'll kind of flick it there hopefully next to the mic you can hear uh, how nice this feels uh, it's definitely not a cheap feeling piece of jewelry they have a whole bunch of different options as well one thing that's really cool about the shine on app is that you can actually uh, do an engraving upsell which means your customers can engrave the back of the jewelry with whatever message they want that's completely built into the shine on uh, app and it's going to be automatic right if the customer wants to do it they can do it right on your store. You don't need any additional apps to make this happen. Take a look here at some of the other options that Shine On has. In addition to regular print on demand jewelry, they also have these really cool uh, buyer upload slash uh, message card items. You can see here that basically uh, the customer is going to be uploading a photo to the piece of jewelry and then the print on demand portion is the actual card behind uh, the piece of jewelry. Right, so let's say that you're selling in a niche like military. You can see that they made a military design there on the back, and then the keychain uh, is the buyer personalized part. They also have just some standard uh, print on demand jewelry. As we scroll down, uh, you'll see some of that. Let me keep going here. So here's some more, right? They have uh, cross necklaces, and then these are, like I said, these are fully print on demand. Whatever design you want to go on the cross, uh, there's no message card with these ones, right? They even have rings, uh, they have uh, more keychain options, bracelets, dog tags, which I already showed you. Uh, definitely a really cool uh, app. The shipping uh, on these, I think, is like under $5 each. The processing time is super fast. They have facilities in the United States. So if you are selling to US based customers, Customers, odds are they are going to receive their orders very, very quickly. They also have a sh uh, they also have a Facebook group too as well. So if you wanted to join that and you had questions for them, uh, you could ask. But definitely a cool app if you want to sell jewelry. I would 100% recommend it. Now the next app uh, is another free app. Uh, based in China. Now, they are free, right? Before I talked about Pillow Profits based in China, but that one you have to pay for. Subliminator is free. Uh, and this one specializes in all over print products. We're gonna jump into the app and show you some other features that they have, but uh, I think this uh, is one of the coolest things that I have ever seen. This is a baseball jersey that the wonderful people over at Subliminator uh, put together for me. They put my name on the back. You can see here, I'll just 
use the other camera and show you some close-ups. Uh, you can see that all over uh, the jersey they have you know my branding and uh, the little ninja guy. It's a really cool uh, baseball jersey uh, product. Definitely high quality. Uh, it feels like an actual uh, baseball jersey would with that nylon uh, material. Definitely super cool. High quality, vibrant all over print uh, here with this product. I'll also show you another hoodie here uh, from them. This is going to be their zip hoodie, so it has a zipper. Um, definitely a super cool product uh, as well. High quality, vibrant print. You can see uh, here that everything does look very good. Uh, they are going to allow you to choose two different color strings on their hoodies, so you can do white or black, I believe. Uh, but definitely really nice stuff uh, inside of the Subliminator app. They are based in China, so we'll talk a little bit about shipping times and things like that. Uh, let's jump into the app. So here we are inside of the Subliminator app. We'll kind of scroll through and take a look at a few of the products. Products, but I think one of the coolest things about this app is that all of the shipping prices are included inside of the price, meaning you're not going to have an additional charge. Whatever price you see is what you actually pay. Uh, they have some really unique stuff. Like I showed you the baseball jersey. They also have uh, short sleeve button down shirts. They have cloaks, leggings, uh, your standard tank tops, jigsaw puzzles. We'll go to the next page here uh, and show you a few more. They have more hoodies, joggers, uh, tumblers, which I actually have right here. Give me one sec. This here is an example of the Subliminator Tumbler. Um, definitely very nice print quality. You can see there as it focuses that this tumbler uh, is super nice. Uh, it is a stainless steel, so inside uh, is stainless steel. Comes with this nice hard plastic lid. Definitely a cool product. Another cool product they have are these dog hoodies right here. You don't see these too often if you're selling to people who have dogs and you wanted to make them a hoodie for a specific niche that they may belong to. Uh, it would be a pretty cool option. And I'm talking about the human, uh, the owner belonging to a niche, not the dog. A couple of things that are cool about the Subliminator app is they actually uh, have something in place uh, that uh, that prevents people from seeing that the item is actually coming from China. So they're not actually lying, they just have their own uh, tracking service that doesn't show any Chinese cities or anything like that. It'll only start showing locations once it actually leaves China. So definitely a cool feature here. Uh, they do have some express options uh, as well. You can see that all of their products are manufactured in their uh, facility in China. One thing to note too though is that Subliminator is actually a company that is based in the Netherlands. They just happen to make all of their stuff and ship all of their stuff from China. But definitely a great app. It's free to use. They have a lot of really cool all over printed products and I would recommend you to check them out if that sounds like something you want to sell. Now the number one app today uh, is actually number one uh, because of the pricing. Uh, when it comes to selling apparel, which is the most uh, popular print on demand product line out there, right? T-shirts, hoodies, uh, all that stuff, long sleeve shirts, even some all over printed apparel like leggings and hoodies and zip hoodies and all that stuff. Uh, the pricing is the most important thing. Uh, and if you are selling with this app, you are going to enjoy the cheapest prices out there. Quality uh, will not take a hit. Uh, I have reviewed a ton of their products in the past. I'm going to show you a few today uh, as well, but it is Printify. Uh, this is a free app. They have suppliers all over the world. Basically, uh, what Printify does is they connect you to various print providers. They don't actually print anything themselves, but with their app, they connect you to a print provider that is local to you or local to your customers that you're trying to reach. Uh, they really are the cheapest for uh, apparel products. I will show you guys inside of their app in a few seconds. We'll take a look at some of their products now. So I have three uh, in front of me that we're going to start with. Um, the first is this water bottle. Pretty standard uh, bottle here. Really high quality, vibrant print. Uh, we'll take a look at some mugs as well. These are mugs that I send uh, to students of mine that hit sales milestones on their store. And lastly, we have uh, a pillow here. 
uh, really high quality printing, um, definitely nothing to complain about. I also have reviewed uh, their shirts and their hoodies in the past, both here on my channel and also inside of the POD Ninjas Facebook group, so you guys can check out those reviews there as well. But let's jump into the app uh, and learn a little bit about what they have to offer. So here we are inside of the Printify app, and one of the first things that I want to show you guys, as you can see uh, on each product, that there is a regular price and a Printify premium price. Now, Printify uh, is uh, someone who I have an affiliation with, and they have provided a discount code to my audience to receive a free month of Printify premium. So if you wanted to get started with Printify and get a free month of premium pricing by having that account, uh, there's a link down in the description with some more information. Like I said, this is only a free month. This service, Printify premium, does cost $29.99 a month. Uh, so after your free month, uh, if you don't want it, you can you can cancel it. But if you're making any sort of daily sales with their app, definitely would recommend because you're going to save 20% every single time you sell one of their products. Now, take a look at some of the all over printed products here. Uh, you can see that when we click in uh, to one of them, you will see the print providers that uh, produce this product. Like I said before, Printify connects you to print providers all over the world. And this one here is coming from a company called MWW On Demand. Now these pair of leggings, they don't have any other suppliers that are making the products. If they did, you would see them listed here and you'll be able to uh, hover over. You can see that this print provider ranking is based on a couple of different different factors. All of their providers are going to be ranked. Uh, you can click shipping and more details and see some more information about the pricing. But like I said, uh, if you wanted to use uh, Printify and you're selling any sort of apparel, this is the app that I recommend because it's going to be the cheapest prices without jeopardizing quality. They also have an eco-friendly section, so if you wanted to sell any sort of organic uh, clothing, you definitely could. Uh, and like I said, you'll enjoy the 20% off with that Printify premium uh, discount code. So hopefully, uh, you guys did enjoy this video. It did take a little while to make, so if you are enjoying my content and you think I'm doing a good job, please make sure to smash that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel uh, if you are new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, so I said I would give you a rundown on how you can articulate your shipping. So it's really quite simple, right? Let's say that the print on demand app says that your product is going to take 21 days, uh, potentially at the longest to arrive to your customers. Now you wouldn't want to just write on your product page uh, that it could take 21 days. You'd wanna have a more creative way to say that. And one thing you can do is you can write on your product page or your shipping policy page something that says, uh, because we are an on-demand business model, as soon as you place your order, we will get working on your product right away. So please uh, expect uh, a tracking number between four and 11 business days. And then you would say, once your product ships, uh, shipping times are quoted by the carrier as taking four to 12 business days. Uh, and if you write that, someone reading it is going to say, yeah, that sounds uh, logical. That doesn't seem too out of the ordinary. But what you did was you actually told them uh, that at a maximum, it could take over 20 business days for it to arrive. And the thing about business days is they are only Monday through Friday. So what you really did is told them it could take up to 25 business days. Again, just a really subtle way for you to clearly articulate your times, but also not just write uh, on your product page that it's going to take 21 days uh, or longer, right? So hopefully that helps.